and an amazing song as always today we've got Cast and Walk Away one of my favourite songs from that Britpop era um, loved Cast you know wrote some amazing songs uh, saw them a few times supporting Oasis as well I think it was Noel that actually uh, got them a record deal and everything uh, this is an amazing song I did this one years ago this is sort of an updated version I think this is a much better version going to show you how to get the intro down a little bit more now if you do want the chords, lyrics and the strumming pattern as always I'm going to post it up on my Patreon page so there'll be a link to that in the comments also a link in the description and the way that that works you just click on the link sign up for as little as a couple of quid a month or however much you want to pledge it's up to you guys it's all very much appreciated and it gives you access to you know pretty much all the chords lyrics and strumming patterns to the songs I've done over the past 15 months so there's a lot of stuff up there now there's some exclusive videos that are up on YouTube, a lot of videos from the archive and some stuff to coincide with the technique lessons that I do, you know, some strumming exercises, um, there's some stuff to coincide with the scales, the blues stuff. So what are you waiting for? Link in the comments, link in the description. Uh, thanks for your continued support, thanks everyone who's subscribed. Now if you are subscribed and you haven't done already, a further way you could help me out is hitting that little notification bell that's somewhere down there so you get notified every time I post a video up. And if you want to, please go over and give me a like on social media, so I'm Wayne Arguitar on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram and now also TikTok as you always say, I'm trying to get down with the kids. Anyway, that's enough of me rambling without further ado, let's get to it. Okay, so I'll just point out first of all that the guitar is tuned down a semitone, obviously, to play in the original key of this song. Now, the best way to do that is either download a guitar tuner app, either on your phone or your iPad, uh, most of them are free. Or another tip is if you put the cap out on the first fret, you take your guitar tuner, you tune your guitar up as if it's in standard tuning, take the capo off, everything is then dropped down a semitone. So your E is then an E flat, your A is an A flat and your D is a D flat etc okay or if you can't be bothered to do that if you don't want to faff around you could sing it you know just in an open tuning but it is quite a difficult song to sing this so uh, I think it's much easier obviously to sing in this key and this key is based on the original recording as well okay so uh, the chords to the intro are a little bit different than what I do in the verse because we're going to get these little sort of embellishments in so I'll just talk through the chords for the intro it's going to be a C then we're going to do a G. Now you want to do the G with your second, third little pinky, the third fret on the top E string if you want to get these little embellishments in. We're going to go to an A minor. Then we're going to go back to a G. Then we're going to do an F major 7, standard one for the intro. Uh, back to the G, and then C, and then back to the G again. Okay? So if you want to get this little embellishment in around the intro, I think it's really cool. So you strum the C, you put your little pinky on the third fret on the B string, so what you get is, take that off, emphasize the top E string, put the little pinky back on the third fret of the B, take it off, and then take the first finger off. So what we get is, then we go to the G, it's nice to add your first finger on the first fret of the B string doing the G sus4 then take it off again so what we get is okay we're going to do exactly the same thing on the A minor to the G and we're going to F major 7 exactly the same then the C Ok, 
Okay, quite tricky to do, but if you can do that, you know, it's going to get it sort of closer to what's actually going on in the song. Okay, so when we start strumming the chords, I'll do a couple of chords slightly different. So what we do here, we go a C, a C slash B instead of the G. I think uh, this is what John Powers does, actually does. I've watched him sort of playing this live. Uh, so if you've never seen that chord before, you just take the C chord, uh, take the third finger off, move the second finger up to the second fret on the A string, keep the first finger where it is. That's going to be a C slash B, okay? Um, then we go to the A minor, G, F major 7, this time I'm doing it with a C bass in, so all we do, if you've never seen me do that before, is take the F major 7, move your third finger to the third fret on the A string, little pinky will go third fret on the D string, okay? We go to G, and then C, and then back to G again. So what we get is... Okay, and that would carry on sort of into the verse. Okay, so I'll just play that through so you can see how that gels together with the words. And then there's a couple of different parts right at the end that just walk away a bit. I'll just read the chords out so you can see what happens. So we got... If you all they've got to say You look but turned away Just walk away, walk away If you've said All you've got to say The words just slip away Just walk with C G F Again That's what they say What they say What they say We go to a G You gotta walk Goes around again. You've played all the games they played. You played them yesterday. Just walk away, walk away. You've been where you wanna go. You've seen I've got to show. Just walk away, walk away, walk away. That's the CGF. What they say, what they say, what they say You gotta walk away Okay, so that's a little instrumental That's basically, you know, just going around the verse chords again And just before you go into the bridge It's nice to do that little intro again Where we go Okay, and now you've got this little bridge part which is basically going from a C to a G. Now you must believe me, never lose your dreams. Now you must believe me, never lose your dreams. Okay, and then we just got one more verse. Uh, all it does right at the end of the song is it will go walk away, walk away, walk away. That's what they say, what they say, what they say Go to a G Gotta walk away Today And we finish there on a C chord, okay? So uh, a strumming pattern that would pretty much work around a lot of these chords So the chords that go sort of half a bar I tend to do a down, down, down up And the chords that go for a full bar will be a down, down, or down, up, down, down, down up so if you hear that around, you know, mainly the verse chords, you've got a down, 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 down. Okay, and the chords that go for a full bar, let's take example the bridge, the C and the G, we've got the C, down, 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 G. much all you're gonna need okay so thanks very much for watching hope you all enjoyed that uh, what an amazing song and uh, great memories of this song I think it was sort of a you know just a really poignant song you know from that Britpop scene one of my favorite cast songs this uh, you know it's up there 
probably in my top ten of you know favourite songs ever. Absolutely love this song. Really means a lot to me. So uh, I say, I hope you all dug that. I have done a few cast lessons. Uh, fine time. Uh, all rights up there, I think. Now, if there is any that you'd like to request, it doesn't even have to be cast. It can be anything, you know, 50s to modern day that's going to work well on an acoustic or an electric guitar within reason. So the easiest way to get your request in is obviously comment below the video. Or if you want to find me a personal message over on those social media platforms I suggested at the start of the video, you're very welcome to. I just always point out that I do get quite a lot of requests and I do have to sort of hemp at them a little bit. You know, some things work, some things don't. I hope you all appreciate that. But please do keep your requests coming in because that's what keeps this channel going and it's very much appreciated. Another thing that's very much appreciated, I'll quickly mention it again. If you are subscribed, thank you very much. And if you haven't done already, please hit that little notification bell to so get notified every time I post a video up and you can keep up to date with my last they sort of come thick and fast these days so there we go uh, the patron thing uh, sorry to keep banging on about it you want the chords lyrics and the strumming pattern to not only this song pretty much everything I've done over the past 15 months with exclusive videos and other things up there uh, there's a link to that in the description also a link in the comments what you're waiting for go and sign up if you don't want to do that I've got a new feature which is like a super thanks link that's under the video there you can click on that and make a small donation again massively appreciated I always say word of mouth is a powerful thing so if you if you dig what I do please like and share my videos tell your friends tell your work colleagues anyone you know plays guitar please point them in my direction I really appreciate that so that just leads me to say whatever time of day it is you're watching maybe morning day night thank you very much and I'll catch you all for lesson very soon take care